Hey guys, welcome back to Toops Time. It has been a little over four weeks since autumn. One of our milk cows was artificially inseminated. If you have not seen that video, there it is right there. Go ahead and watch it because this is actually the sequel to that one. Today we are going to be getting our stuff ready to go milk and then right before or maybe right in the middle of milking i haven't really decided yet make up your mind already we are going to have nick from cooper cattle come back down and he is going to draw a little blood out of autumn's tail and preg check her so this should be exciting we've never had this done before so follow along with us and you'll see exactly what goes on during a preg check for a cow you'll have to just forgive the lighting out here it is still barely daylight, although this is a little later than I normally milk autumn. We're gonna be checking her around 7.30 was the plan, so I have all of my milking schedule pushed back just a little bit to make it to where this guy don't have to show up super early in the morning just to do a preg check. Obviously, after only a little over a month of being pregnant, if she actually did get pregnant, she's not going to have a, a baby calf in there that you're able to actually stick your hand through her anus and feel like you do later on during preg check. So today's preg check is actually going to be a blood draw. I've never actually seen this type of preg check done, so I just figured it would be super interesting for you guys. With that said, being it is blood being drawn, we're going to be sending this blood off and the results will actually be back in a week and that'll be a different short video. Fingers crossed that she actually is pregnant because if she is not, then you have to actually pay for this entire AI process all over again and start over from the beginning and wait another month and then fingers crossed she's pregnant, you know? So just how it works with the AI. Well, I was going to just wait for Nick to get here before I drove down to where the cows are, but I've got a little bit of feed to offload anyway, so I'm going to go ahead and head down there and wait for him. Ladies, daddy's here. <laughs> If this is your first time tuning into Toops Time, let me go ahead and introduce you to our girl. This here is Autumn. She's the one that we're actually preg checking today. And she's also the first one of two cows that were the first cows here on our property. We have five total milk cows right now. This one is Hazel. In there next to Autumn is Missy. We have Olive right over here. And then the baby that Autumn had this spring is this one right here. She don't look too much like a baby anymore, but that's Maple. Grows really fast. We have jerseys here on our property. Nick is just pulling in, so he should be down here shortly. Hey, guess what girls? We have company. 
Nick is here. The man has arrived. You excited, Autumn? No. You excited to see if you are pregnant? I'm really just here for the sweet yeah? peep. I thought so. What do you think, Missy? Are you excited? Not really. She's like, I have no idea what's going on. What about you, Olive? You excited? What's the hype all about? No. I guess I'm the only one. Yeah, I'd say so. Thanks for backing me up, girls. Leaving me hanging. No problem, Cody. Cody. So last time we did the artificial insemination, I had Autumn in here. I milked her. Nick showed up. And after she was done milking, he came and AI'd her. The problem with that was she ended up being in the stanchion so long she pooped twice and she never poops in the stanchion. So we're gonna try it a little different. I'm gonna wait till he's ready. And then I'm gonna go ahead and bring her in here. May affect her letting down, I'm not sure. But it'll keep her from pooping all on our stanchion. All right, so this is Nick. We're about to go ahead and let this girl into the stanchion and let her think she's just doing her normal milking routine. And Nick's gonna draw a little bit of blood from her. Uh, do they typically feel this or is this like a very not so sensitive part of their uh, body? Usually ain't too sensitive. But... Okay. You want me to put her in the head stall or? Oh, yeah. Okay, I'll go. Okay. Good girl. She's like, why is that generator not on like it always is? Something's different. All right. I guess that big whopping thing right there is the vein. A little hard to eat here on Autumn. And that's it. Wow, that was easy. Made that look way too easy, Nick. <laughs> cool. Awesome. Now we just have to wait about... And then we'll have the results. Yep, we're going to wait about one week and we'll have the results to see if this girl's pregnant. If she's not, we'll have to do it all over, huh? Yep. All right, dude. Well, guys and gals, that is it. <laughs> that was the preg check. Uh, it didn't seem like a whole lot to us, but all he actually had to do was draw blood out of the tail. Autumn is a really good cow. She stood pretty still for him, so it went super quick and easy, and now he's just gonna ship those results off, and we'll get them back in about a week to tell us if we have to start this whole AI process over again. If you guys like this video, please go ahead and hit that like button, subscribe button, and share, and we'll see you on the next one whenever we actually get those results back. God bless you guys.